Hello students, welcome to science classes. Now this video was much awaited. We have already asked so many times in the comment section about the physics strategy, the analysis and the study plan. So today we are bringing all three physics strategy, analysis and along with that the study plan and a small crash course. Okay. Now we don't know how much whether we will be able to complete the whole thing but we are trying to almost cover around 40 to 50 marks out of KCP because in the physics section because the time is short so we don't have that much of time okay so we will be giving you a very crisp analysis so that according to the time you can do it and you can be smart and you can utilize these one and a half month to the best and get 45 plus in KCT physics section so let's see so first the most important thing is to know the scoring topics okay before starting the preparation of any subject we need to prepare how the subject is what is the exam pattern what is the plus and minus so we already know it consists of 60 questions one mark for each no negative marking now let's come to what are the important chapters which you need to focus okay so first important thing is electrostats students in electrostats it is basically chapter one of and chapter 2 ok so electrostatic fields and capacitance both chapters are included it is of the high weighted 6 to 7 almost we did an analysis of past 2014 to 2020 paper from 2014 to 2020 we did an analysis and we came out to this conclusion ok current electricity again 6 to 7 so first 3 chapters of your class 12th is among the most important and good weightage Moving charges of magnetism, again a very high scoring topic, ok, 5 to 6, now alternating current, 3 to 4, wave optics, 3 to 4, ray optics, again 3, semiconductors, 3 to 4, now these are the topics which are above 3 weightage, ok, so you can say, and are good weightage, so in this case scenario, the 12th portion dominates, so students, your 12th portion almost comes around let's say 45 to 50 percent of the mark 45 to 50 marks your 12th quotient almost comes around for 45 to 50 marks and from the 11th the first few it is almost around 10 to 50 okay so give more and more importance and emphasis on the 12 topics and among those topics these are the most scoring topics a lot of questions are like simple concept based some are very simple formula based and some are good questions okay where you have to think so these scoring topics they contain all three kinds of questions so very important so do take care of this ok now coming to the next part the average ones but these are like more on the numerical side based ok so basically more on the numerical side based ok and but they are good easy also in the concept wise dual nature all modern physics you can classify these three as modern physics ok so once you do this it is also very scoring ok so dual nature atoms nuclear 2 to what is it 3 2 to 4 2 to 3 electromagnetic induction around 2 magnetism and matter around 2 so if you are able to finish the scoring plus the average scoring so you will be able to score somewhere around 42 to 48 students ok so you will be easily able to score 42 to 48 and which is very decent ok so you will be able to cross 45 plus among these two only now coming to the other non scoring which is like either coming not that often or coming for like almost around 1 to 2 or 0 to 1 markers ok so these are these chapters units and measurements it's easy you can go through this chapter you need to a bit go through because sometimes it get mixed this is easy this again you can go through this motion in a plane or 3d you can go through this is comparatively it comes easy only question based on work energy theorem mostly it comes ok so you can just go through a rotation pretty simple basic idea if you have of the chapter if you have the basic idea of the chapter you will be able to solve most of these questions and from the 11th topic what they have done is if you see the clear analysis or in depth analysis what you see that simple concept questions okay or simple just basic questions are coming from the 11th so they don't want you to do the in depth knowledge they don't want you to have the in depth knowledge of it but they want you to have a basic knowledge because uh, they want you to have the basic knowledge basic knowledge so that while going while you are going to engineering 
you should at least know what is about okay so all these level first few topics you should go through thoroughly okay uh, not in depth but on the chapter what are the basic problems and what's the content of the chapter okay now so these all if you go through it will help you if you really want to get 60 out of 60 if you just want to score 1045 so 1045 these two are more than enough student the scoring topics and the average scoring ones if you want to score 60 out of 60 you have to go through the basics of this chapter what are the basic formulas okay so basics the formulas okay what different definitions and concepts are so basic concepts okay so you have to go through these much okay now once you are done this is the basic analysis now a things fluctuate a bit up or a bit down it can fluctuate okay and what do you say so that is there always fluctuation will be there but still on an average if you do this much you will be able to you will be in a very good position to score 45 plus or decent 50 plus now coming to the strategy how will find a strategy which way to do it and which way not to we have divided i need a study plan for you all since a lot of you have asked sir we need a study plan we need a what do you say something on the crash kind of thing for the physics part also so we came up with a crash okay we won't be able to teach you everything but we'll try to deliver the best so that you can score 45 plus easily okay so in our first week from 13th to 20th we'll be able to deliver the first two chapters electro okay chapter 1 chapter 2 and we'll try to give you current okay so in this we're going to give you the concept video okay plus the pyq all solved and some important questions in the form of dpp okay so these three things we'll give you okay once you have done make a short note and since the website is also available now you can upload it and the website link is and the website name is online sam classes dot in okay so you can go to the website download the stuff we'll be putting up more often okay we got a bit delayed because we were on a huge pressure things a lot of things we had to do but now we are going on more focused way so you'll be able to see things in a much faster way so go through okay second week somewhere around 21st to 28th we'll be going with moving charges and magnetism mcm okay magnetism and matter mmm and emi okay so moving charges and magnetism magnetism and matter and emi will be trying to take care of this in the second one third one will be going for the uh, from 29th to 5th okay will be going on modern physics and semiconductor so basically this will be modern plus semiconductor okay so same thing will be giving pyq dpp and concept part okay so concept along with the formula so you can expect like everything will be given almost so we have to work very hard okay now and the last week and the last week and the last week what we'll have is on from 6th to 15th we'll have these are a bit on the tougher side ac wave optics and ray optics now we won't be able to provide you with the pu first pu topics now if you cover this much of the topics you'll be able to score minimum 42 plus to 48 plus or around 50 okay so in the crash as of now seeing the time and the everything we're involved we'll be able to provide you only with this much students okay but we'll try to make sure this is delivered along with the maths on time so that you don't have to what is it be disappointed you don't have to worry okay you start studying go to the basics add for the books part ncrt okay ncrt should be your focus now in ncrt just or what you can do is if you are not able to understand much of in depth of ncrt any video in the youtube you can just go through and just see the basics of anything okay any chapter you take it get to know what are the basics and what and in details we'll bring in the concept video okay so that's it for all students and be prepared we are bringing next the chemistry also very fast it will be delivered to you okay work hard 100% dedication thank you